So this video is related if you produce a video using UCAT or any of the other allegedly free video recording apps, sometimes it will put a hashtag. Where do you find that? So once you upload in YouTube, make sure you have the YouTube Studio app installed. Have a look at my video related to YouTube Studio, how to install it, etc. So you're going to tap on your YouTube Studio. And then what you're going to do next is you're going to look for a video in your content library. If it's the last one you think it is, again, this is from an Android device. Top left here, there's three horizontal dashes. So I'm going to tap on that. Then what I'm going to do is go to my videos. Notice that the language differs from your main YouTube studio on your desktop. That's called now, they call it content instead of videos. So you're going to tap on videos in here. And then what you're going to do is you're going to find that video. And let's say it's my last one here. So I'm going to go on here and tap on here. And notice that there's a pencil here at the top right hand side. There's a pencil here. Oops. So that pencil, you tap it to edit. And then when you go down here, it asks you to add a description. Add to playlist and look. Is one hidden so again this is a new cut so you're gonna have a section called add cut add tags and notice how you cut sneaked one in so what you're gonna do is just hit the X here to get rid of it so that little X you need to tap on that to get rid of it so what I'm gonna do is just tap on that X tap again and it's gone so now it says for me to add tags and again you're gonna add keywords that relate with a hashtag obviously that relate to your particular content okay so that's how you get rid of the tags that are added automatically by some of the so-called free video editors on mainly i focus on android but if you do have um, something that runs on an ipad or on an iphone you may have to get here quite similarly, but it may differ. I don't support Apple usually, so you're going to have to see another video for that from somebody else. Thank you very much.